do you currently have a straight hair installed and you don't have heat protectant don't worry let me show you how to make it at home hi guys merry christmas i'm currently making this video on christmas eve and eventually when i post it it might be christmas day so merry christmas Welcome back to my channel. It's your favorite girl, the Queen of Hearts, and I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to make heat protectant at home with simple ingredients, and this actually works because I use this for my previous video. Check my page, you see where I use this DIY heat protectant, and I'm just going to leave a video here as you can see. I can assure you this is very easy to make and if you have the ingredients at home, lucky you. If this is your first time of tuning in, thank you so much for tuning in to my channel. Before we dive in, don't forget to subscribe and hit on the notification bell. And if you want to see how to make your own heat protector, make sure you keep watch. Let's get into it. The first thing you want to do is to get an empty spray bottle, some aloe vera gel. Aloe vera contains vitamin C and E, which helps to prevent dryness and then you add that to the bottle and add some leave-in conditioning milk and after that is done you can also add olive oil if you have coconut oil or glycerin or vitamin e oil you can use that as well and half cup of water should be enough to mix the ingredients after you've added everything just make sure you shake the mixture thoroughly and this is my matted curly hair i just wanted to show you guys that this actually also works on your curly hair as well and you should definitely try that oh his name is bo and he wants you to subscribe please subscribe thank you so much for watching this video guys hope this video was helpful if it was give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell i'll see you guys in my next video Bye.